And here's what I entitled it. Here's what I titled it. As I put my papers back together. The title of this opinion piece is, Would You Miss Me If I Were Gone? Ladies and gentlemen, if after today I was gone, would you miss me? Or would you fill up your time with something else and the memory of me would quickly fade away? Have I left something with you in mind, thought and spirit that will stick with you through time? Or may apply as a useful tool in your life? Did I make a difference in your life when it came to idealism and esprit de corps when it comes to our nation? Was I clear in my illustrations on weapons use, care and safety? Did I present to you special guests who shared their special skills and traits and with hope may have rubbed off their skills to you? Did I speak words of encouragement? What is that, Trey? I don't know. Right in the middle of my opinion piece that I was doing so well. It was just our radio. Did I speak words of encouragement? Did I express an air of friendship? Did I make you laugh, make you think, make you move to action? All of these things and more is what I hope to have conveyed to all of you. I hope that it's worthy of holding on to, thinking about and applying parts of it to your own way of being. As I hope all these things, I more so hope that you are doing the same to others and not living your life in a bubble. We can all be mentors, teachers, advisors, friends. So many out there need someone like that. That someone could be you, can be you, is you. You can be the difference in someone's life. You can be a positive influence to someone who has lost their way or just needs some good advice. Do you want to live as a mere vapor, here today and gone tomorrow? Your life experiences can't be bought. They must be lived, but they can be shared. Sharing your knowledge, wisdom, your life experiences can help to prevent people from making certain mistakes, can encourage others to enlighten others, or enlighten others. What a waste it would be to die with all that you have learned but have not shared. We are all walking encyclopedias filled with the knowledge of life. We are all teachers with something to teach. We all have diplomas from UHK, and you know what that is, the University of Hard Knocks. We are all certified as professors to teach the curriculum to the freshman class. So ladies and gentlemen, when the net of life catches you and it's your turn to leave this world, will you be remembered for all that you shared or will you be forgotten? Just another occupier of space, a consumer of food, a laborer in the workforce, or will you be remembered as a mentor, a teacher, friend, companion to those who need what you have learned? I hope it's the latter for both you and me. And with that, ladies and gentlemen, I also want to say it's been an awesome show this year, and I thank all of those who have helped to make it possible. The show staff, definitely all the sponsors, and all my special guests. Thank you, God bless, and let's do it better in 2018. Whoa! <laughs> that was awesome. We're going to take a break. We'll see you on the other side.